the original story of Ark Survival Evolved began and ended on planet Earth. The complete crew has completed all the previous obstacles to get here, but will start in on extinction with nothing proved to be too much for the complete crew. What was once a thriving homeworld is now a corrupt and desolate shell of its former self, and infested with element. Our ultimate goal here is to defeat the gargantuan titans which dominate the planet. And to do that, we'll need an army of creatures unlike what we have tamed before. The hunt, of course, continues for a high-level Giga, with so many wild ones being slain at this point, and the best level that the crew has managed to find is a 115. But the King of Beasts is not the only creature the crew will need to bring to the fray. A high-level Tequet has been spotted out in the desert, so myself and Tribe Mate Vexing Cat team up to try and tame it. Oh, sh uh oh. No way. <laughs> I was aimed nowhere near your head. I am I am out and I'm on the ground. You you've fallen off as well, haven't you? Um And things are eating on. me. Things are eating you. Right, hang on. I'm on my way. I'm coming to the rescue. It's gonna cost me my legs. Where are you? I can't see you. Oh there you are. I wasn't aiming anywhere near you then, that's lies. <laughs> Switching from the Tapajara to the Argentavis works much better when trying to tame these creatures in twos, and rather than running the risk of tranquilizing my tribe mate again while mid-flight, we revert back to a tried and tested method. I utilize some spike walls that we've been getting from the orbital supply drops, and take extra care that the tame remains uninterrupted. In the end, it tames out with 51 points in melee and 45 points in health. If we can find a female tech quets at some point, building a battle quets will be on the agenda and another tool in our arsenal. But because much of the focus this week has been squarely on finding higher level creatures, a crew comes together to explore the snow cave in search of the artifact of the void and grab some explorer notes, which is now a requirement for completing Ark since the release of the Fjordor map. Uncovering all notes will now be a requirement, so now's as good a time as any to get started. I have returned. Ew. Welcome back. Yay. <laughs> Are you gonna join us in the snow cave, Shiny? No. What? We're next to Okay, I've decided is my least favorite. <laughs> I think the desert cave is the nicest on the interior. I was gonna say, I haven't seen many y yetis yet, and then... Spoke too, <laughs> yeah, spoke too soon. Yeah, spoke too soon. Oh, yeah, he's. This guy might be uh, good enough to take on a red drop now. Oh, yeah. Make short work of this cave, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> you can almost fit a Titan into here. Yeah, <laughs> I prefer the slimmer, skinnier caves. Are you fat shaming the cave, James? Kind of. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I found a drop. No one's gonna like where it is, though. You see it? You Look straight across. Oh, yeah, I see blow. it. You can jump. Ooh, can text it. Mm -hmm. yeah, I can jump, I got this. Jeez, you look like an ant all the way over there. It does, well, yeah. We do have a long neck BP now, but it's only a journey moon. What was the damage on that one, Romeo? Oh. Uh, 197. That's actually not bad. It's not yeah, bad. It's not bad. Yeah. Especially for the mats. <laughs> it's probably yeah. a lot cheaper. Uh, that mask yeah, it's only 685 metal. Yeah, cracked and skill it up a bit. 180 there. hide. 144 wood. That's really cheap. That Mastercraft oh, one that you passed off that I inherited from you is only 177. Mm. The one I've got now is a ramshackle at 117, so... Oh, shit. <laughs> Yeah, my one is a 192. This one's a 197, so this is the best one we got. <laughs> Gosh. Gotcha. Artifact to the void. It's quite a cool looking artifact, really? like that one. Mm -hmm. Very Shez. Very pink. I, mean, I think it's one of Shez's favorite artifacts, to be fair. It is. It's so oh. neat. Oh, Romeo. Wow. I do the honors. Go for it, mate. Feeling lucky, Shaz. I don't know, I've been spending a lot of time with Romeo and he is not very lucky. I'm concerned that he might have a job. <laughs> oh dear. 
We have got yeah, no, a... She's got a point. Ascendant. Wow. Sarko Sado. Yeah. <laughs> One off. <laughs> and wow. a pair of journeyman ghillie boots. Uh, 82 armor. Blueprint. But, yeah. <laughs> There is one up there? Yeah, one, yeah. one who waits is here. What in? <laughs> He's here. It's tucked away in, in the little corner. Yeah, I kind of looked a little bit, but I didn't look enough. I just know that at some point I'm going to have to do it. I'm just going to have to get them all. So I, I, at this point, I don't care. And if I'm leveling up a Giga, I may as well <laughs> just grab them. Oh, yeah. Did you know the Giga swim here? Oh yeah, <laughs> they got water in the wrong bit. Uh huh. <laughs> so they have a little swim. It's a little. Uh... Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> that stuff happens all over the Crystal Isles, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> uh... <laughs> oh dear. I'm just flying around Crystal Isles and just getting like dismounted off the flyer so you get water sometimes. Yep. <laughs> Watch your fire slowly float into nothingness. Yep. That was amazing. Yeah, I know there can be a drop on these ledges out here somewhere. Oh yeah, there's a drop mm. here. Found a red one. There is? Yeah. Oh, nice. You can go for a James. You got some good luck. No, you got no, some good no, luck. I just oh. got a Sarko saddle, mate. My luck's out. Okay, my luck is... Okay, no, it's now... Well, you're rolling then, Chez. What have we got? Alright. Uh, I'm not allowed to touch anything else now. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, 225 Mastercraft crossbow and a one off pair of Pied boots. Pied wow, wow, boots. What, what a waste of a red drop, Chez. I know, I know. <laughs> Honestly, let's be real here. <laughs> Red drops in caves tend to be awful compared to like the yellow yes. drops. Or the blue drops, it seems. Yeah. Wow. Like, more times than not, it's a red drop in a cave that gives me mm -hmm. useless blueprints. Like, grenade blueprints. Mm -hmm. And holoscope blueprints. Holoscope, grenade, um, and GPS. Pots, GPS, oh, yep. GPS. Like, that's all the stuff that I get from the reds. The red drops are a lie. Moments later. Oh, have you ruined it again, Chess? I ruined it again. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, chitin, one off helmet, and a apprentice diary on our saddle. Wow. <laughs> Yellow drops are much better than red drops. So, you get GPS <laughs> at red drops. <laughs> yeah, James, don't go anywhere. Yeah, Where go on. Right, yeah, ready? I tried stepping it. Go on in. <laughs> oh, a double. <laughs> Boing. Both of them. I didn't see two. I, there's a twofer. The breeding and imprinting of Gigas is a time-consuming process. The complete crew has found a reasonable Giga saddle blueprint, but the stats we have on our creatures are not good enough to tackle any of the Titans. However, during the process of making an army, the complete crew has plenty of throwaway creatures. Myself, tribe mate Romeo and Shizella head out to tackle the tribe's first purple drop. Okay, are we ready? Yeah, I think so. I think there's okay. enough of these things. Is it, we should only have like two ways in, right? Hopefully, yeah. Oh, oh. why run first? Oh, wow. I bet set everything too aggressive. Go on, CG, whatever you are. Oh, oh there's the shield gone. Oh dear. We could. We're fine. Get up. <laughs> I mean, the first shield, that don't last very long anyway. It lasted longer than I expected. Oh, that way's finished. Uh, we've got two seconds. Okay. Oh. Nice. Now we should be good. Watch it all just 
jump off the ledge. Yeah, I can see Rock Drake coming down. You can hear Rock Drakes. <laughs> yeah, we gotta be careful with the Rock Drakes on the shield. You can see dragons are. coming towards me. You guys will never kill me. That wyvern is too high to reach. Mm hmm. And I don't trust. Oh, I don't trust. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No. Oh no. <laughs> will, the sh will the shield protect us? No. Will the oh, no. S will the above uh, will above us protect us? I do not know. If it hits shares, it's gonna take me and you out as well, Romy. I suppose there is that. Mm -hmm. you sure, it's wise to out. shove us all in one place. Maybe we should just spread out. <laughs> <laughs> Too late to move now. I'm not budging. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kind of safe. No guts, no glory. Yeah, you say that. It's yeah. It's, mm, um, say oh. that and it lands right there. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at them all coming down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's one on head right, but Morris, right, get, 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 get cover. Oh no! No, no, no! Oh, oh my god, that hit exactly where I was. <laughs> oh, that was so close. That stego got annihilated. Oh my god. There's one left. Okay. Pretty more kickers. <laughs> Pushing me off the cliff. I can't <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even realise how close I was to going off today. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, bye, Giga. Where's that one gone? Down there. <laughs> I'm not getting down yet. I know it's purple drop, but I'm gonna get uncumbered. I'll Some do it. Stego. Okay. Stego. I got it. I got it. I'll try, I'll try and put things up. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's a big pile of resources too. Mm -hmm. Like all those pearls. Metal, oh yeah, really? see that? Thousand pearls. Didn't notice the Managama sale. Uh, saddle there, but you see in here. Rosa saddle. <laughs> but is yeah. Very nice. Not bad. Not, not bad, not bad hole. It's pretty good, right? Mm. And it only cost us a few crappy gigas and a couple. Hmm. With our first purple drop complete, the crew continues to get stronger. The grind will of course continue next time and a huge thanks to those of you who have been kind enough to like and watch and indeed comment on our progress. And an extra big thank you to my patrons for your continued support. But until next time, I'm James from Complete Games, and I'll see you. Thousands of tears later. So hold the radio wheel and hit uh, passenger seats, and there's a front seat and a rear seat. And when you board the rear seat, you're going to be facing backwards. Ah, <gasps> oh, that's what we were doing wrong, Vex. Why have I not... Right, now let me see. I, well, I can't shoot you in the head. Well, this is better. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> right, well, I'm gonna have to put like, this. I'm gonna have to put this at the end of the video, Shez, like, because everybody's gonna be down in the comments, like, why are you both in the same seat on the Tapajara? Like, <laughs> <laughs> mistakes yeah. were made. Mistakes were made.